What's up guys? Jake Fry, the car guy here with the Car Guys YouTube channel. I've got some terrible news for us, some sad news. This is the last video we're gonna be shooting like this on location here, walking behind the camera and Jake Fry, the car guy in front of it. Cause we've got a new format coming to you, baby. Sad. We're gonna be on two locations now, Savannah and- Double the cars. Double the, double the content. Double the content. Double the energy. We're bringing it to you. We're working hard to get more content out. I'm going to be out in Savannah. Walker Paul's going to be here in Statesboro. We're covering the whole of Southeast Georgia from the coast to the capital. We got Georgia covered. Guys, what we got on hand here today, a beautiful 2022 Ford Bronco four door as compared with a Jeep Wrangler four door. Both of these have some aftermarket, some upfits, some upgrades. We're gonna get into a little bit of that. We've got our Bronco, we've got our Jeep. So let's dive in, guys. This right here is a 2022 Bronco Outer Banks with the beautiful Oxford white lettering and gloss black front grille, front fascia that comes with your Outer Banks package. We've got a heavy duty, steel front bumper as well as front hooks with mounting points on either hook for an additional grill guard bumper guard whatever you need as far as our jeep wrangler we are looking at a plastic you know cheap rhymes with jeep <laughs> front bumper with the steel front hooks and i believe i'm not a jeep expert but i believe you can use that as a mounting point as well this is i believe a 2017 jeep so a little bit of year difference here but still very much in line with what the Jeep Wrangler models are coming with today. Um, you've got your front grille, your front fascia. This is an up badge Jeep, so one of their higher trim levels as well. You've got your fog lights, you've got your lights in the bumper. And now the customer that previously had this vehicle that traded it in gave us these nice trail grappler tires, minnows with the 20 inch rims. And those are by LRG, the large rim group. We've got, I believe, factory running boards for both the front and second door coming down the side. And as far as space, we're gonna to need to unlock it. The Jeep is not as spacious on the interior as our 2022 Ford Bronco. Now this Jeep has actually got custom cat skin leather that we did with one of our local partners here. Shout out to Mike the Leather Guy. And he does a great job of these aftermarket leather upfits for vehicles. He can do it in just about anything we sell. So let us know if you're looking for leather in a cloth vehicle. We'll make it happen. Now as far as space, you can see visually a good amount of space difference. You can also see once we open it up, the improved cabin space in your 2022 Bronco. This Outer Banks package is going to come with the power seats eight way. So that includes lumbar support up, down, um leaning the seat as well and this has your marine uh, leather seats from the factory so you don't have to upgrade that if you go with this trim level with this order type of your outer banks bronco now this is the 12 inch optional bigger screen center touch screen that's going to have apple carplay android auto built-in connected navigation and this is, I believe, Sync 4. So you've got two options displayed on the screen at once. You can see right now we're changing the settings as well as displaying our XM radio music options. This will do Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, Bluetooth. And it's also got a Bronco specific center productivity screen that looks super nice. Ford did a great job designing that. Let's check out these goat modes, Jake. And goat modes are something that the Jeep just cannot keep up with. We've got our goes on all terrain modes, including normal. We've got a sports mode and eco mode for that performance. You see that cool fiery animation. We've got a slippery mode with automatic four wheel drive shifting when we're getting into our mud rut modes and our sand modes. So this is an absolute off-road beast. It is class standard four wheel drive, unlike the Wrangler. We know we've got two engine options with our Ford Bronco, the 2.3 and the 2.7 paired both with the 10 speed automatic transmission same thing in the mustang same thing in the trucks it's a great choice we've also got a seven speed manual 
transmission paired with the 2.3 liter EcoBoost turbo engine. And that is going to allow you to get that rock crawler mode that Ford has, de has uh, developed. Super cool, great for getting outdoors, getting off road. Now you'll notice both vehicles have aftermarket tires, all terrain, bigger tires, and both of them came with a full size spare. As far as our Bronco, you see the backup camera there. I don't believe there is a backup camera present in our Jeep Wrangler, and there are still Jeep Wranglers today, correct me if I'm wrong, that come without a backup camera, without power locking doors, you know, et cetera, et cetera. Um, we've got our plastic steel uh, rear bumper as well as a plastic rear bumper on the Jeep. One difference here is that we've got backup sensors integrated into our rear bumper, letting you know how close you're getting to something in front of you. Now, the Jeep rear hatch functions much the same way as the Bronco rear hatch. You will have more space with your 2022 Bronco though. As, and if we lift up this little hiding spot, we've got our Bronco bag with our tool to um, undo our Bronco specific of different screw points, super cool. Bronco branded, like everything that comes with your Ford Bronco. Got your Ford badging on the back and your Bronco badging. Super clean look. Both of these vehicles are single exit exhaust and both of them have trailer setups. Now this Bronco will tow 3,500 pounds. I believe the Jeep will tow a little bit less and will only come with a four pin connector. Our Bronco has both a four pin and a seven pin connector giving you more capability for when you're towing. Walker, I think this has been a great opportunity. We also want to announce the happy winner, the lucky winner of our wireless charger giveaway. Shout out to the one and only Brian Bala of Statesboro, Georgia. Um, I believe he also has a YouTube channel. We're going to drop a link to that in the description below. A lot of great fishing content from that guy, but congrats to him on the wireless charger winner. Stay tuned because we've got more action, more content, and more vehicles coming to you all of 2022. Now we've got two locations on lock. Jake Fry, the car guy, here with the one and only Walker Paul, not Paul Walker Tedders. <laughs> Jake Fry, the car guy, for the car guys, JC Lewis Ford. I'm going to see you soon.